Welcome to Math Kit Tutor with Tammy. Here I am to tell you about another classic game that is rolling around on the internet. It has several different names. Um, I like to call it Snake Eyes. Snake Eyes is when you roll two ones. And then of course rolling a snake eye would be a one. Either one of those you do not want to get snake eyes in this game. And you have several different rounds. You can both play on your own score pad with your dry erase marker or you can split the score pad in half and you can even play more players, four players with both of your score pads. Uh, I'll split this one in half for convenience sake. The first player rolls and they rolled a three and a two. They did not roll a snake eye so they can record their score and they can get greedy and keep rolling. You've got the little cups there if you prefer to make it authentic. Now we have a six. We can add that to it and we can keep rolling. Um, but do know that probability, you can teach them about probability, that there's one six chance of rolling a snake eye. Um, so far so good. I'm at six plus two is eight. I can add eight to my score and I'm going to stop there. I got 19 for that round. Um, the next person then would go and oh no, they rolled a snake eye, so they would get zero points for that round. Then it is the first person's turn again. And now we're on the end part. Six and two is eight. They're not gonna get greedy, they're already winning. So now it's the other person's turn. And they got 11. Oh, they're not caught up. They have 11, the other person has 27 points. Uh, the child can use a calculator to see how much they need, or they can just do the math right on the sheet. They're going to go again because they're going to get greedy there. And 10, so far it paid off. They can add 10 to their score for that round. So they have 21. They can see by doing mental math that that's 27 so far. So they want to try to catch up, so they're going to keep going. Oh, no snake eyes yet. There's 10 more to their score. Now they have 31 and they caught up. So they are going to call that round good. Now player one's going to go again. They have a six. They're going to stop there and not get greedy. Player two has a four and a two and a six. Oh my, she knows that she's ahead. Uh, so she's going to let the other player go and not get greedy. Eight. Oh, it's kind of neck and neck, so this player's going to go again. Oh, no, a snake eye. A snake eye means they get zero points. They have to cancel out that eight and get zero. Now, let's say the next person's turn. They roll, instead of this roll, they accidentally roll a double snake eyes right there. Do you know what that means? That means that this person gets zero points thus far. So all their points are canceled out. So now this person would have 19 plus eight plus six plus zero, and this person would have zero. And they only have one more round to get greedy or to hold back and find their total. The total is the highest score. And that is Snake Eyes, my friends. Have fun with it.